Hola, hola mi gente. Welcome back to my channel. I am super excited to be back and be filming this video today. I just got off my shift. I made it home, dropped off my kids, and made it back home again. So now that I am settled, a little bit of my energy has been released from my shift. I just want to do my paycheck. This is my first paycheck of November, so it should be... 24 or 25 out of 26 uh it's 24. <clears throat> so my gross pay was 32.65 a lot has been happening at work <laughs> so i got two raises the first one i finally 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 submitted that pesky evidence-based project and i got to present that bumped me up i think it was six dollars but because I presented during the season of uh, focal point reviews, it was a blackout period. So for the focal point review, that was the annual re annual uh, raise that we get. I got a, so I went from 34 to 36, if I'm not mistaken, almost a dollar raise. But now I'm at $40.97. So if you are new to my channel, I am, well, I was, oh my goodness, I was a new grad nurse. I have been practicing I'll make one year by myself independently. <laughs> and I still ask a million and one questions throughout my shift. But I work at nights at a med search unit. And I, so this is my base salary. I get hired at 32 and a half. And then slowly but surely, I've been going up and up and up. Some of them are like yearly corrections. Some of them are like um, uh, yearly raises. So the one that boosts me up the fastest was graduating my nursing program. That's part of a residency. Um, it's like a magnet for nursing. And so here we are now. This is not including any differentials that I get at night. Those are like four and a half um, from like uh, midnight until 7 a.m. And then when we clock in, I think it's a three and a quarter differential. But don't quote me on that. I'll, I'll add it in if you want me to keep adding it into my sh my videos. And also there's a dollar for week weekends. So that is Friday, not Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Every day that you clock in for Saturday and Sunday, you get an hour added. And so this has not kicked in yet. This happened last night <laughs> on the 8th. So that is amazing. That's perfect because it's my kid's birthday on the 15th. And they want a kitchen set, which I've already ordered. And also they want to order some cupcake and unicorns, I believe. I don't know where I'm going. I don't know if I want to go to Costco or I want to go to Sam's or if I want to go to my local H-E-B. I am a Texas girly, so we love, we stand for H-E-B. <laughs> so, yay, 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 round of applause. We were very anticipating all of us together, this raise and how much it was going to be. And so it is a nice kick from within the, the last two years. Okay, moving forward. My paycheck, again, the, this is not including any of the raises. This is me still at 34 and some change. So basically, the gross was 32.65. I do get deducted. Um, they do remove the 401k, which is up to the match. And then they do remove insurance for all of my kids. And I think it's like $300 for six of us and they also remove taxes so my net pay for today is 26.98 and this is how i broke it down okay so giving is going to be 134 savings is 269 which this is i think they take out 300 dollars automatically where i have it set up to go to my sinking funds and ally for like my long-term savings. I have like senior year for my 15 year old. Um, 
also have for my pet insurance whenever she needs to go to the vet visits we can take her with that money i have for a new car any car maintenance and i think the flooring to be honest so for food we have 269 this pay period utilities are 134 housing i budgeted 674 transportation is 269 insurance is 269 and this includes uh, car insurance and house insurance. I'm sorry, health insurance. Um, <clears throat> for health, it's 134. This isn't going to be included for um, the gym membership that we have. There's also going to be using this money for my husband to go get his cleaning because it's his birthday as well. So I think he has to get his deep cleaning and um, some fillers in his cavities. I also have 134 for lifestyle. This is mainly like for any memberships that we have, like Peacock, Hulu, Netflix, those type of memberships. Also have personal, that's 269. This includes anything um, that is a want, basically anything like clothing, a uh, pair of shoes, anything that is a want that is not a need will go in here. And also I have MIC, miscellaneous, which is 134. Oh, that is the grand total of 2697 And if you're wondering, I still have my braces, y'all. <laughs> that is my next goal, to get my braces off before my birthday. My birthday is in April, so hopefully they're gone by then. <laughs> right? Moving forward. This is my priority. It's going to be my chase card. If you are new to my channel or this is the first time you watch my video, welcome. I do have about six credit cards that I owe. Some of them I use for points to go to Disney World. And I also have $34,000 in student loans. I only send like $76, pay, $76 each pay period. So so we can prioritize paying off debt. And this is my card, so we are gonna take this one out, 8721, as soon as we can. I just paid off my Best Buy, so I kinda let off the, the speedometer. I did purchase a television for my kids for their Christmas, that's what they really wanted it, and it was only $100. I don't know how my husband found that promotion, so kudos to him. Mm. And moving forward, I just want to say that even though I don't show up here invisibly or <laughs> you don't see me as often as I would like to be here, I just want to let you know that you matter and that I believe in you. I believe in your capability of making your wildest dreams come true. If you feel it in your stomach, if you feel it in your chest, if you know that this is something that you want to accomplish and against, it's your dream. So just believe in it. Nobody else has to believe in your dream. Um, <laughs> nobody has ever believed 100% of the time in my dreams. And so here we are. Um, I had a lot of people tell me verbally, express to me, to my face, um, that I shouldn't be going to nursing. One of them was my employer because they were losing out on an employee. And so <laughs> instead of me going to be, make my life better, they kind of wanted to abuse me in that way. <laughs> but and also had family members that told me that they didn't believe me going into school because I already had my family. However, I always knew that I wanted to be a mama first because it was in my heart. And people then were against that dream of mine because I was considered to be too young. But now here we are. <laughs> We are thriving and we are growing and we are doing the best that we can every single day. And my family knows how proud I am of them and how much I love them and how much I believe of them. And I just want to say it to you in case nobody else tells you that you matter and that I believe in you. Hasta la próxima, mi gente. See you later. <laughs> Hopefully it's not another hiatus. Bye.